Hey, what's up guys? This is Average Asian Tech and today we are going to take a look at an accessory for your keyboard. These are rounded keycaps for your mechanical keyboard to add a typewriter style feel for just under $20. Also, I want to thank Spring and Original Shop for sending this in for review. All links are in the description. As you can see on the box, this is the 104 key version meant for the 104 key keyboards. So the item itself comes very nicely packaged in a box with a matte feeling and the keycaps themselves. I'm pretty disappointed that this set doesn't come with a keycap puller because I had to dig one out of my closet. For the purpose of this review, I'm going to use the Sadie's K10 as a sacrificial keyboard and I did do a review on this keyboard. So if you want to check it out, you can check it out on the card on the top right corner of your screen. And with no further ado, let's pull out all the keycaps and replace them with the new ones. Okay, so first thing I noticed after I put these on is how different the key clackiness is. So for reference, here's what they sound like side by side. When looking at it from the side and from a slight angle, you can see how much more exposed the switch is. Typing on the keyboard is a bit difficult at first since I'm used to using the square keycaps, but I found out that after 1-2 to two hours of typing, I got used to it. The keycaps are very comfortable to type on since they do have a concave design. One thing that I did have trouble doing is remembering all the keyboard shortcuts to change the LED colors and the volume and things like that. So if you decide to purchase one, I suggest that you do take a picture of your shortcuts or memorize them before installing these keycaps. So overall, I think this keyboard is just an accessory and not a necessity, but it's a cool thing to have and this is targeted for people who one, want the typewriter to look and feel for under $20 without buying one that has rounded keycaps that cost upwards or $100, or two, have worn out keycaps that need to be replaced. So that's it for this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.